He's playing the guitar, he's moving his feet, he's got shakers on each ankle. Steve was a living groove machine. Being all that we can be. He left behind this treasure trove of music and art. I heard the Kingston Trio and people like that, and I wanted to become a musician. <laughs> very curious about this character with clocks. When you ask if I love you. You sound like you're 32 people playing at once. There were so many sounds coming out of the guy. Those are my toenail clippings. Where are the rest of the guys? He's filling in all the musical space. His skills with the uh, thump were so uh, extremely good. That's a guy who's in charge of what he's doing. In Nashville, that was the first time we met Tommy. And it was this train effect that just kept going. Stand on that crossroads, that's when you must decide. Will you walk away or will you ride? Right, right. I majored in painting in the Philadelphia College of Art and Design. There's an element of Asian art in Steve. He was able to do some blends that were a little bit unusual. Out with the old, in with the new, on to the next pole. Touring Europe is relatively new for me. And take me to the station, hop a plane, pull out my passport. And my pocket change. He could play four or five days straight, sometimes more. The fact that he had created such a following, especially in Europe. They're more likely in Europe to listen to obscure artists that are not getting the airplay and the exposure here. She can run my number, she can run my life. She can be my ticket, she can be my wife. And he came over and it was just... It was fantastic from the first moment. When it's late after midnight It's as dark as a tomb The industry was, you know, accepting him. I'm in the system now. I'm a national steel, I'm a 